customers. A London business which makes duffel coats suffered a setback after having to relocate from its site on the Olympic Park. But despite that, its exports have grown by more than 800% over the past six years. Its owners say they've done this by relying on a highly skilled workforce in the local area. And their success has now won them a national award. Victoria Graham has more. Well, the Queen's Award for Enterprise International Trade, I'm sure, will mean an awful lot to this British company, which employs a lot of the Bangladeshi community who have the skills required to make these incredibly high-quality duffel coats. Of course, the duffel coat, a fashion staple from the 60s, but the history goes way back. Joining me now are co-founders of London Tradition, Mahmoud Chowdhury and Rob Houston. Thank you for joining me. Um, how have you transformed the duffel coat, which has such a history, into the modern day to make this business such a a success. Duffel coat was people knows as a big coat with food and yolk. What I did, I translate this big coat into a slim and attractive uh, for young generation who liked it. And from 2008, when whole world economy falling, we start growing and we grow so fast. As a business, you've done incredibly well. Rob Houston, also co-founder of London Tradition, what does this award mean for you going into the future? Well, clearly we're thrilled by this. I mean, it's great news. We're selling a British product made in England, made in London. It's very important to our buyers, the provenance of the product. They are hopefully going to be ringing on our doorbell uh, very soon, if not today, saying, wow, that's fantastic. It's really going to help our sales going forward. We're thrilled by it. Thank you both very much. We'll hear more from the uh, London tradition on uh, BBC London tonight at 6.30. In the meantime, the Queen's Award will be awarded to this company in July.